a good day uh today i want to show you how to actually uh, do proper referencing uh using my word ai we are going to be using two tools two different tools my word ai and uh, google scholar uh, google scholar is a repository for scholarly jobs seminar jobs academic articles and several other kind of articles like that so that is where you find the doi and other repositories for such kind of jobs so today we, i'm going to show you how to use my word ai to actually write with accurate uh, referencing using uh, uh, two different tools which is my word ai and google scholar so this is my word ai uh, user dashboard as you all know uh, from here, if you are using a laptop, you click here, which is Research Writer and more. We are already on the so uh, on chapter one. This is chapter one. All these you are seeing are chapter one. Please, I want to give this note. Avoid using this like this chapter one. This is just an intro, a, a kind of summary uh, for those that have been asking me using chapter one or using chapter two. Or using chapter three to write instead use these subsections under it you see intro background of study so today we are going to be working with the background of studies because it has something to do with uh, references so i quickly click on the on the uh, background of studies uh and then it came up with this uh, here is the research topic here is what are your research questions here is uh, references from google scholar so what do i do first the first thing i need to do is to go to google scholar and then i put in my topic my topic i want to use i've already pasted it here uh, i've already pasted it here on google scholar is assessing the impact of diverse animal health management practices uh, on disease prevention and control at ABC farms in Delta State. This is Nigeria particularly. So I click here. And then you can see different different uh, reference article, uh, articles you can use for referencing concerning this whole uh, subject. So I, I decide to choose on this. So I'll click this, it will open, watch me clearly. This is how to get the reference work done. Okay, now this is an article. So I copy the title and everything way down here. That includes the title, the authors, the date of publication, and every other thing I may need, the page range. So I copy this. I head over to uh, my Word AI, and then inside my Word AI, I decide to use the AI assisted teacher. <coughs> so while it's opening now in the AI assisted teacher, what am I to do? I've copied that, which I copied from a uh, uh, Google scholar uh, coming to AI assisted teacher. I'll ask the AI assisted teacher. Uh, okay. Let's create a new chat because of uh, Okay, good. Now I ask it here. I said, please convert, convert this to mm -hmm, maybe seventh edition, seventh edition, edition of edition of APA. Okay, referencing, referencing, okay. And then I've pasted that, which I copied, and then I, I, I send it. So let's see, you see that which I copied? I just gave it a simple instruction. So it's gonna give me that immediately, okay? So can you see, it's already writing it out, already writing it, so it's done. So it's on. Now, what I need to do is I copy this. 
sorry please oh man still writing okay i just copy this this is it i've gotten the reference style and then you can do this as much as for as much as different references maybe you need 30 40 references for your work then i copy that i head to uh my background of studies where i needed it i paste it here it's actually optional but i'm gonna use it i paste it there and then that's all i make sure i have enough units if i don't have enough word count i can buy here this is my word count the number that i have and then i can now click generate my word ai will automatically begin to write it it will now crawl that particular reference and write from there so it's already writing now you can see that it's already writing there is a background of studies you can see it's writing it's beautiful you can see it has referenced a particular one so it's not going to bring you a, a unnecessary reference that do not that do not exist I get to me this is actually existing because uh, that is one way by which people actually check uh, ai ai uh, ai uh, by which people use to do ai detections so using this method now with my word ai you can actually write uh, with proper reference and all these articles all these write-ups that is being written are actually collected directly from that reference you can see let's take example the scholarly landscape reveals a plethora of studies that delves into the intricacies of animal health management for instance Moata et al 2011 provide a comprehensive analysis of production characteristics and disease prevalence in southeast nigeria offering a valuable insight into heart health management this research underscores the importance of understanding the regional disease dynamics and management strategies despite the wealth of existing and all that so that is how to get this done thank you so much you can do that for as many uh, 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 uh reference as possible as you want and you can harness as many reference as you want that is one secret uh, by going to google play store and then putting in your uh, topic there after putting in your topic you you act you after putting in your topic you can you can you can even select range that is uh, maybe i need 2017 2016 to 2023 you can select range from the left hand side and it will give you range and you can still go ahead with your work you right you click here and then copy all that i ask you to copy and then you paste it on my word ai ai assisted teacher it understand that algorithms and then you ask it specifically to uh, you ask it specifically to actually change this to uh this and uh, maybe seventh edition of apa uh, referencing style and you can ask it not to add any form of uh, note so it will it will not add all these notes you are seeing to to build that all out for you and then your work is as good as ready thank you